manifest for someone else? This is the question that I get almost on a daily basis. So stay to the end because I'm gonna answer all your questions about that topic right here. So subscribe and comment below and let me know what you think. I am the Chief Manifestation and Success Coach, CEO and Founder of Diamond Academy, and I have had an explosive 18 months. I have mastered the art and science of manifestation, and I am here to teach you a few things that I've learned along the way. Today, I'm going to be talking about how, if you can, manifest for someone else. So stay to the end because I have some tips on how you can help influence others through your manifestations. The really easy answer to this question about if you can manifest for someone else is no. I know that's kind of hard to hear, but to be quite honest, it is impossible for you to manifest for them the reason being is that it is our energy. It's the frequency that we vibrate at that mirrors outside of us. So you can't 100% control how somebody else is operating or the energy that they are in. It doesn't mean that you can't help them. You certainly can, but you cannot directly manifest for them. The key here though is, is that you can help someone to manifest something that they desire. That's the biggest difference. While it may be disappointing for me to tell you that no, you cannot manifest for someone else, there are a few things that you can do. And this is where you can use your influence. So the first thing that I would highly suggest is that whatever it is that you're learning, Teach it to other people, practice it on yourself, start to figure out how it's done, and teach people around you how to start thinking in the same way that you are, how to raise their vibration, how to operate on a new frequency so that they can start to manifest what they want. So this is the thing. If somebody is trying to manifest something, you know what it is, you want to help them to do it. You can give them tips and pointers to help them to operate on that frequency. But so many people want to manifest things for somebody else and that person doesn't even want it for themselves. So this is where you're going to be spending a lot of time, a lot of energy trying to help that person achieve something that they don't necessarily even want but you can help someone to achieve something that they want as long as you know exactly what that is. Now, I have used manifestation a couple of different times for other people to assist in helping them get what they want. One example is my mother. She lost her vision suddenly. It went completely blurry. She was seeing double and it was a very, very stressful situation for her. And I knew that she wanted nothing more than her vision to go back to normal for that blurred vision to stop, the double vision to stop. And while the physicians were telling her that they didn't know when or if it would go back to normal, I went inside and I made sure I was super, super focused with my prayers, with my visualizations, and with my gratitudes for manifestation to see nothing but my mom's vision returning back to the way that it was before. So I stayed super focused on that goal. I had her super focused on that goal. And within two weeks, her vision came back. So we were both working on it together. But if she didn't desire that, or if she was too worried about what else could go wrong, or had a belief that her vision would never come back, it would have been very challenging for me to have an impact because her frequency, her energy, determines the outcome of her life. She's the cause to her effect. The second thing that you can do to help other people is to respect what they want. 
This is sometimes hard for us. We want others to want what we want. We want others to have big goals and dreams and visions. And they may not be there yet. They may not be ready for it. A lot of people ask me, how can I get my wife or my husband to start studying this material too? My best piece of advice is to hold the vision of them doing so, and one day they will. But trying to force anything, it truly does negate the action that you want. So stay focused on the goal, and it will happen for you and for them when the time is right. And the third thing that you can do to help others, which is by far the most important thing, is to be the inspiration that they need. It's not hard, it's actually quite easy, and it just means that you're in spirit, that you are aligned with everything that you want, that you live in a place of gratitude, of love, of joy. Because when you live there, it is contagious. Other people want to live there too. And so they may not see the possibilities today of what they can have, but you can be the inspiration to show them just what they're capable of and how easy it is to achieve it. I hope that you found this information helpful. If you do, I'd love it if you left a comment down below letting me know your biggest aha moment. Subscribe and like this video because I'm going to have so much more incredible manifestation content for you so that you can keep uh, creating the life of your dreams. So with gratitude, Kathleen Cameron.